the mindfulness will solve so many problems. There are several problems, several major problems um, that we often face. One of them is uh, the problem that you keep yourself, right? Of course, negative things, if you keep within yourself, is really bad. It can, um, over the time, can really harm oneself. So it's very important that not to focus on the negative things all the time. It's important to know what are the problems so you know you can look for the solutions, but not really bug down on those things. The moment you see problem, you need to put your energy into the solutions. What are the solutions for these problems? So that's, that's a problem within oneself. Then the second one comes, um, and then you should not, I'm not saying that you should ignore it. You should really take care of it to lessen those problems and remove those problems. But then there's another problem that is in between people, oneself and others, with your family members, with your close friends, with your colleagues, right? And uh, normally whoever is important with you, uh, whoever, you know, people who care for you, they're the one that you probably will be communicating the most and you have stronger feeling towards them. So most of our problems, imagine, you know, if you don't have communication problem with anyone in the world, how much less problems we might have, right? So communication is a big part and is the one that creates lots of negative karma. It's a big gate for creating negative karma or positive karma. But with the mindfulness, we can help a lot. Uh, we can filter, basically. We can filter first so we don't harm others as much. 